Okay. Hello everybody and welcome to Sam's Fitness. Today we're demonstrating the PowerTech shape system. Now, the advantage of this machine is it's great for um, studios, home, or even in commercial gyms. The great thing about this machine is that it has a small foot plate, okay, and, it, and you may be looking at it thinking that uh, it looks very similar to a cable crossover, but it has much more to offer than a cable crossover. Meaning that we have an optional bench that you can use for chest pressing movements, shoulder pressing movements, and even lat or back movements. Now, <clears throat> most people think because of the compact range or the compact foot plate here, that the cable crossover is a disadvantage here. Most people at, uh, at uh, clubs and gyms are used to using cable crossovers that have a wide <coughs> foot plate and the cables are located out to the side. It's true that maybe it is easier to do the position because you're just pushing through a straight line line of motion. But on this machine here, we virtually get the same movement, we just have to change hand positions. So instead of regularly, because the weight is placed out to the side of us, we cannot push down in this manner, <coughs> get an effective chest train. What we need to do is work back from this position here and bring the hands forward as such. Now in effect, <coughs> this is more isolating for the chest than a normal cable crossover because we're unable to bring the deltoid trap in and lats to push down. So you'll find with this movement you won't be able to use as much weight with a cable crossover. So the advantage is here is that we don't need to overspend on putting too much weight or spending extra expense on, on, on buying lots of weight for this machine. We can get an effective movement with around 20 to 30 kilos pushing through the pec. And this way here, as you can see, the motion is all pectoral. It's just that you have to be mindful of the hand position. So instead of bringing it as a normal cable crossover, hands together like that, we bring them together like that. So bring them behind us to stretch the pecs, squeeze together. Rep range here, keeping in between about 12 to 15 for about three sets. As you can see, getting a full range of motion in the back. Now most cable crossovers, <coughs> you can do curling, upright rows, tricep press downs. Now this, this on the shape system, on the power check shape system, you can do exactly the same thing, okay? But this is the advantage this has the second advantage this has over a regular cable crossover is that we have the addition of a bench. Now with the addition of the bench, we can do a lap pull down loop. Just pulling down into the lats. Again, you can change hand positions, rotate them in, pulling this way, rotating them out, pulling this way, or keeping them neutral, pulling this way. Just hitting different parts of the back, but virtually the same movement. <coughs> so that's your lap work there. 